We are gathered here today to witness and celebrate the marriage of Arazu Kuzarani to Arthur Alvarez. As these two have known and loved and lived with each other for many years. And if you do know them, you're probably asking yourselves, <laughs> why did it take so long? My mom, who's prone to corniness, would say that they are uh, two peas in a pod. They are the yin to the other's yang, and they are truly beautiful together. First one on the way. Let's begin your vows of marriage if we could. Arzu, it's not very often you find someone as special as you in life. I'm lucky I didn't have to look very long. Arthur, you truly are my best friend. Just being around you puts me at ease and makes me feel happy. Our conversations are authentic. Our chemistry is natural. You're the most caring, thoughtful, and dependable person I've ever met. I look forward to all the great moments and all the laughs that lie ahead. We will build our perfect lives with lots of little dogs. <laughs> Most importantly, I vow to keep you first, even during football season. I promise to watch football with you. <laughs> and to always make sure you get wings and breakfast burritos for the rest of our lives. <laughs> Today, I take you as my wife, my best friend, and the love of my life, as long as we both shall live. You're the strength I didn't know I needed, the joy I didn't know I lacked, and today I choose to spend the rest of my life with you. I love you. Arthur, I give you the string as a symbol of my love. With the pledge to love you today, tomorrow, always, and forever. Arthur and Arzu, having been created for one another and finding one another amongst all others, and so it shall be from this day forward, you are officially husband and wife. You may kiss the bride. about Arthur. Amy, Arzu, and I were shopping at Forever 21. And Arzu casually says, so this guy reached out to me on Facebook. He's hot, he's in a band. And I'm like, well, what did he say? And she said, um, do I know you? <laughs> After meeting Arthur for the first two minutes, I knew my best friend had met her forever person. <laughs> Today I was watching how they interact and you guys just, you can tell you're almost like, and I mean this in a very sweet way, but like when you watch an elderly couple when they're in their, <laughs> their 80s. <laughs> But, and they're like just taking care of each other, like helping each other up from a table or like cradling each other. It's like you guys just take care of each other. It's just, it's so sweet. I always told Arizu this to show her the level of my love. I love her from here to moon and back. 
All the stars in the sky plus infinity. And I love you both the same now. Good luck to you, and we always be there to support you. This is my son, my only child. I'm so proud of him. I always thought he was very intelligent, and when he chose Arzu as his wife, I was like, okay, yeah, I'm right. That, yeah, he is. I want to read something I wrote recently, and it's called Love Pandemic. Last night I had a dream that I was touched by an angel and became infected with unconditional love. Sorry, uh, this phone is not my phone, so anyways. Oh, thank you, thank you. No more wars, no more hates, only forgiveness and love to share. May we never recover from the love pandemic.